Our mid lane matchup, though, is the peculiar one. That duo is kind of a classic combo in itself. Even back in the day, what's a simple Chakra Fissure mid lane? Our first gank is going to be very successful as Miracle will pick up the first blood on the Ember Spirit. The December Spirit is going to have a really bad time. He can't even TP right now. He needs Looks to walk like back to the lane. They may get something their way, but that blast comes out and it helps them at least get a little bit of return fire. The only opening seems to be possibly in the mid lane. If a chain setup, it could be successful. They move in with a coconut. The follow up borrowed strike. But here comes Curl looking to save the day. Snowball's on forward and they're getting the cuckoo takedown. Miracle holds strong as he pops out the Sunder and lives on. Now they turn for Tim's and it's a double kill for Miracle. This is going disastrous for TNC. Tim's bodyguarding Raven a bit so he can oh, get away Tim's. safely and the root is there. Oh, in mid lane, Miracle also going to be able to score another kill. That's two kills for Miracle. While that's all going down, he's also going to be able to three. pick up the tier two. Turns around, gets the Sunder, looks to chase down Cuckoo, but Cuckoo will jump away or at least scouting out the Roche side here. 1437 leads out the charge, but Tama Man, oh, first hit Tama. Rude. He already lost half of his life, are you serious? He's trying to save him with the help of the mech, but the blast just comes short. Oh my god, Demon barely lives. The shards, not gonna quite catch him. The snowball though, should. But the burrow strike comes out. They're doing everything they can to save their new member. They'll finally get him as Miracle comes in from behind and will bring him down with one simple right click. Now, begins to go to work. Unloads of Fury onto Raven. Can't quite get him, but they'll bend up bringing down the Ember Spirit. A buyback's gonna get forced out as Mind Control dunks it on home. They'll get the finish onto Sam H. The Burrow and the Epi hits onto Liquid, but not enough firepower is gonna Kuroki be there. Alive? No one gonna be going down from Liquid. And the uh, Miracle has meta ready. They'll just wow. go win on those towers right now. Yeah, they're gonna wait out the, and the shapeshift's already over. Now they can begin to play here. They do get a stun onto the bear. Okay. Dunk in from Mind Control is going to get the quick take down of the Witch Doctor. Pull back, vacuum wall. Pretty nice here from Sam. Does a lot of work, but uh, he loses his own life just as fast. Miracle could be in a bit of trouble here. Caught the ready. tower, shoved on forward, turns around, sucks the life right out of Cuckoo and puts him back under. And this one's going to be over. A huge Ooh, convincing nice. win for Liquid. Was there really any chance for TNC in game number one? GG with the Caps Gold. We're gonna see the Queen of Pain coming yeah. through. Our one on one is already over. Uh, GH steps in. He might in. die there. Oh my, a rotation has to come in from 1437. He actually misses the stun! Oh no! Seven, seven minutes in for TNC there, and they had a heavy duel lane to the bottom too. Top lane, Raven looking to move in. Starts hammering it home onto GH, needs one more swing, will get it. Ends up losing his own though shortly after. And looking to make it a two for one special, but Kuro shows up, diving on in. It's gonna be Tim surrounded and burned on up. It turns into a two for one advantage for Liquid instead. Steven's, uh antics from into the woods with the edict here. Miracle hiding on the side of the lane here. Raven looks for an opening on getting a hold of the bear, but the bear will roar him off. Now Miracle begins to move in. He's got the Shadow Blade and a double damage ready to play here. They think they have the upper hand moving in from a Matumba man, but is Miracle going to unleash his fury? Here comes the Requiem, blast it on off. The right clicks begin to come out, but they may be outnumbered here. Now Kuro looking to dive in, drops down the egg, and they can't turn onto it and break it apart. So it's going to be TNC looking to evacuate. A one-for-one -one trade, TNC will be able to get their man, but how much could they end up losing for it? It's Raven now under a lot of pressure, trying to run, gets hit with the Walrus Punch, and eventually comes crashing back down. But Tims jumps in with an epicenter, not going to get the biggest amount of damage, end up Going down at the end of this one. A Sonic Wave, though, will fly forward and help him get the finish on Kuro. It's oh, an absolute bloodbath here. It, and it looks like TNC have had enough. As they try to head out the other way, Miracle has TP'd into the shrine, and now Shadow Blade's on in. He's looking for someone to get a hold of, and he spots He's out Raven. Not get it. Oh, the stun spots him out, and they're going to turn it right over on the Miracle and take him down. GH tries to roll in to help out, but here comes Big the Epi, Epi Burrow combo from TNC. It does a good amount of work and Cuckoo will help get the finish onto GH. Now it's Matuma Man on the run. Things going disastrous for Liquid full team here. Wipe. Woo! Kuro able to make it away, it looks like, but Matuma Man not so fortunate. Triple kill for Cuckoo, and TNC are right back in this series. That's his 10 second debut too, and Sam H has been stalking him. Then Raven shows up, sees the BKBs down, and begins to go to work. That with a sonic wave, they will make quick work of the Shadow Fiend. Now looking hit to go for the follow-up. The, the egg, egg is up, and they're not looking to hit it yet. Now they'll finally put their attention onto it and send it down. The follow-up damage is going to be there for TNC. The wall has been committed, but Cuckoo gets right back into action. 
Has to be a bit careful, a bit low, but it's Raven batting away right now onto mind control. But man. Shrine is ready, man. They move back, they tag it up. GH looks to move back into action, but he will regret it as he gets brought down right after that. Raven has to get right back in. He's been hit with the urn, losing a lot of life. The bear looks to chase him down while Mind Control on the other side dances around with the Queen of Pain. Raven's the one in trouble. Oh my god, the creep's even out for him. They'll finally burn him down. Even in a bit of trouble. Miracle gets hit with the surge. He's hungry. Looking to go on in. It's going to be Tim's now to defend him. And the turnaround from Raven comes out. Miracle is going to get off the Shadow Blade. Oh. Sonic Wave not going to be there. But Cuckoo is still looking for him and will get this man. Miracle goes down. Matumba and man. now Matumba Man could be in trouble next. Mind Control right behind it. Already committed the wall. He's going to be outside the fight. Carapace pops. Stuns there. Mind Control so tanky though. He is going to be out of mana. The dive in. That now the epicenter from Tim's. Hits into the heart of Liquid right now. And they're going to be forced back. Vacuum turnaround, though. Tim's in trouble. Tim's goes down. This Radiant's Bear continues to burn through TNC. Now the Savage Roar sends him back, but Tumble Man going to get Yules up. TNC wait for him to fall and get him down. It's going to be a four-man takedown on Liquid's side. All right, fair enough. Here comes TNC, though. Again. Liquid on the high ground. They have that vision. They move it. Sam H gets a nice stun on the two. The follow-up's there. Raven goes to work. Triple kill for him. My god, he just batted down Liquid. And it looks like they'll be able to get Kuro on top of it, too. They yields him up and bring him down, and that bird is toast. It looks like they are going to be able to still confine the space of Liquid here. TNC should not force a fight right now. It's uh, really risky. Oh, he's going on Shadowfin. Oh, he goes down. We catch the back end of it, it looks like. But uh, the vacuum wall combo response is not going to find anybody. He has no buyback, no gold, though. Stun in from Raven. This looks to be possibly game ending now. They are going to get the snowball from Otombo Man, but they jump right back in for him. Otombo Man's in trouble. I don't think he has a buyback here. They're going to help him out with the greaves. The Sonic Wave's going to be there, and they're going to get him down for two minutes. It looks like TNC are going to be able to secure this one. They break the egg, and Kuro says it's over. Game number two belongs to TNC. They don't have an overly large amount of catch for this Tinker East. It's just a thumb to do. I got my bounty run. I'm oh, feeling good. Knows. Oh. oh, he doubles back the game sense of 9K. He doesn't know. I'm just going to go to lane. Uh-oh, there's a burrow. There's a stun. There's, there's a, stun. a stun. And they're down. It was now at the five-minute mark, but here's Tins again. Moving in. There's the rocket. There's the burrow. Light strike array is there as a follow-up, but no rotations come out from Liquid. The snowball on forward. The blast is going to be there. They are going to get Miracle down, but he turns around with a tornado and will get the cuckoo response. And Tims may be going down too. Yes. I just and gotta turn around and look at that guy smile after he uses Echo on someone. Be right back. Here we go. Rolling on into action. It's gonna be Kuro the captain. Looking to set things up and they almost effortlessly Bam. take down Raven. Here comes the dunk and they're gonna be looking for more. The takedown Alina is also gonna be there. Kuro not even gonna be dropped. Mind Control jumps on the other side. Looking to get the grab on Sam H. Mind Control has been in 7 out of 15 kills, but it feels like it's been a lot of more. Oh, the Snowball Bomb makes its strong debut in the mid lane. A Walrus Punch will help get the finish, and Liquid continue to go on an absolute assault, and it doesn't stop there. Cuckoo going to eat the wrath of the Mighty Meatball. Sam H will be able to get the takedown of Kuro, but that is the only forgiving pick they're going to get. It looks like Sam H also could fall victim, and he will. Get them out of the focus against Nike. They still have the Epi. It's coming out now, but Matama Man's able to pop out the Rage. But Tim's is looking to go for Miracle instead. It's Raven, though, who gets hit with the Assault and goes down on Liquid side. And now, possible turnaround. Miracle forced back. Safely there. GH gets the bailout. Blinding Light. It is a bit of a disenergy with the Echo Slam, but they are still going to get the job done. Double kill for Mind Control. Way too godly in this. They might throw that towel if they want to keep all their teeth for the game number four. Cuckoo's done for. I think this one's over, man. This one looks just as convincing as game number one. Yeah, and it's it over. Is. I don't really blame them. This one was all liquid. Win laning phase, take Roshan, push objectives. That Tim's, who is... Dealing with the pull camps right there. He gets a lot of quills, but it's mid lane where they're gonna be able to get the last slash in. Kuro picks up the first blood. GH connects with the stun. Cuckoo has the invis, looks to sock him. Now commits the shadow strike, but GH could have company helping in. They are gonna be able to get the takedown of the line. Cuckoo quickly blinks out the other direction as Kuroki tries to snowball in. He finds himself caught in a lasso and they will take the twofer. 
There's not. Oh, Cuckoo with the DD. Uh oh, trouble's coming. Shatter Strike gonna find the connection. Now Matuma Man could be in a world of hurt, but they get a good turnaround. Hex, there's the Storm Hammer, and a Sonic Wave will be there. The Snowball not gonna be in time for the save. Now Curl rolls into Raven, and he welcomes him with a big, mighty bat. Knocks him on down. This fight belongs to TNC. GH not gonna be in trouble. GH. A beautiful four man stun, but you are dead, sir. Tim's got to get trapped out, but he gets the long tether away to join his friend Raven. And now what it could be now? them looking to turn it around. And Samu jumps in, though, finds himself eating the finger, and he will be the first to drop. Tim's could be next here. Trap's going to be sprung, but he tethers all the way over to the side of Raven once again. Oh, this shark oh, will not cuckoo. get the block, but it's Cuckoo blinking into action and finds himself eating the Rattle Matuma Man. They will force down Miracle, but that's just going to cost him the Aegis, and they will wait for his second life. As he returns, they quickly beat him on down. It's Sam who actually buys back, rotates to the bottom lane, ties up Miracle, and pulls him on forward because they don't want just Miracle. They want to get some more Liquid members. They're already flying on in. Bristle should be going down next. Raven was even hoping to get an additional target there, but they might need his help to even get the finish onto Mind Control. They step in now, and they'll finally get him done. Bottom lane, rotations are coming in from Liquid side to go for a defense as they spot TNC members. They are going to be able to get the burst on the demon, but now the rotations come out. Raven and company are coming into action now, looking to go for the grab on the Miracle here. They get good stuns yeah, of pain, to I'll defend them off, but here it comes. Sonic Wave from below finds good connection. Miracle forced to go into the meld, but is going to get spotted and taken down. They're looking for Matumba Man next. He pops out the ulti in an attempt to turn her away. He ends up turning around and slashes down Sam. But can he make it away alive? It doesn't look like it. There, Raven will meet him and kill him. Game ending. And it looks like it will be. Cuckoo picks the first mark in. He spots out Miracle. The Hex is going to be there, but the rest of TNC are looking to run on in. The stun's there. Raven goes to work. He becomes godlike as he muscles through the team. There's going to be a setup from Sam as he gets a beautiful lasso play. Locks down with Tumble Man and Liquid say we've had enough. And we're going to a game five in our grand final. Ags, PL just blows up. Oh, the Enigma. All right, that's fine too. Near their creek camp, uh, Weaver can't really farm. First that all right, Cuckoo get the first blood. Uh, we missed the action. Uh, look at this, a Sam H rotation already. You don't always suspect this one. No He's mana on him. In, but yeah, no mana, so he can't dish out the crush. Shards almost block Miracle on the other end, and he has to head the other direction. Now Kuro's going to be forced to snowball in. It slows him a bit, but Miracle is a man on the run. Roche, do me the honor. Not going to get it. Sam H will pick up the last hit, and it's going to be TNC now 2-0. But suddenly, GH gets the grab onto Tim's, pulls him right back in. But it could set up a problem now for Liquid, as the crush will be there for Sam. Cuckoo begins to go to work, and he's going to get another takedown of Kuro. Now up 3-0 for TNC. Sunstrike. Sunstrike. Nice catch there. All right. Miracle, again, though. Miracle. Man, this Sam H. Slardar just hanging about in this mid lane. They want to punish down Miracle. They are going to be able to gobble him up with the snowball. He steps back, gets off the cold snap, but the pressure keeps coming. They will bring him down, and they're looking for more diving in through the trees. They see Kuro, and they decide to make it work. This tri-lane mid lane coming up from TNC is just ruthless. A double kill for Cuckoo. How many more kills before we become uh, a PL I'm not believer? <laughs> <laughs> before uh, we PL believers here. Uh, I know PL is strong in the lane, uh, dominates the invoker yeah. in the laning stage, but uh, I feel the hero needs so much more items than other heroes to actually be effective. GH happened to pick up an Invis rune right they, in front they of TSC. Have they have dust. So they begin to slowly chase him down. They spot him out. They hit him with the amp damage. Sam H looking to go in. Nice savage roar from Matuma Man. We'll bail him out for now. The spear falls from Tim's. He's gone too far. He gets hit with the root, and that will end up popping him. He tries to go for the tether away. No, they're not done yet. They're looking to re-engage once more. They want to get a hold of Kuro. Meanwhile, it's Cuckoo getting the f grab and finish. GH, didn't he just die? Back and dead again? He just died again. Yes. Wow. And now they're looking to move on forward from Atoma Man. The snowball coming out from TNC is quite ridiculous. From TNC, TNC is starting to head back the direction. The bugs are going in. Now Liquid could be in the awkward spot. Nice quick tornado. Cancels out Sam H's nice approach. approach. But the hook pull there from GH will grab a hold of Tebin and pull him into an uncomfortable position. Other TNC members fighting far up north. And the Liquid are now going to be able to move into the pit. Look to go for the finish. Cuckoo, though, also in on the pit. Sam with a huge stun. There black comes hole. the black hole. The Roche goes down. It's Matumbo Man who's able to pick up the Aegis. Liquid. Hold the pit. Double count. Savage Roar and Invoker plus uh, isolating uh, them with Ice Shards. Oh my, look how fast they Dyer's do work on the base. 
Tier 3 already gone. Rax is almost, almost dead. Macopire gonna be forced out. TNC suddenly. Another hook. Oh, GH coming in the late game now. Gets the pullback. Good force, though. Gets him up towards the shrine. They are gonna be able to tag it, but they've already lost Sam H. And they lost to Rax. Matumba Man will be going down, but that's just his ages. Can they get him down for a second time? Matumba Man gets the finish onto Theban from the grave and gets right back into work. Suddenly, Liquid about to walk away with a mid lane set of racks here. Raven, though, wants to get up. Just, All right. I, I don't know if they have enough to... Smoke approach if they do. do. Oh, Another hook. they get the hook. How convenient. Suddenly, Theban, their captain, already going to be taken out of the game. No this buyback. Looks all but too good for Liquid now. As they begin to siege on in, it's Cuckoo trying to hold the line. He gets hit with a deafening blast. The tier three already beginning to crumble now. The bear, unstoppable it would seem, a demolishing down. This one life of the bear, almost able to take the racks alone. They have to force out the glyph. Still have to be privy to where GH is standing. He is looking for the hooks. Not gonna catch one there. Cuckoo looking to move in. The Alacrity Bear though, looking to go for the finish on the racks. And Liquid can do it so safely, waiting back with Mind Control's black hole if TNC dare. Roars off Cuckoo. He actually gave cheese to a bear, so... A... Okay, here we go from TNC. They're looking to jump in. Tornado already, though. The pullback from the Bail Bailmount. Mind Control committing him with the Black Hole to get the bail onto Raven. He does get dropped. Buyback's gonna get forced. They couldn't get him out in time with the relocate. The second Black Hole. This one to lock on in and get the finish for Cuckoo. They can't quite get it. Cuckoo barely able to make it out alive. Oh, Mind Control blinks out, but there is Cuckoo. Cuckoo able to get the chase, finishes Mind Control. Sunstrike will be there. Oh, the doppelganger to dodge the Sunstrike. Now they're looking to surround, surround Miracle. They'll get him down. That's just the Aegis. GH on the other side, also going to get finished. Our TNC somehow going to be able to get the upper hand of this fight. Miracle, a man on the run. Oh, oh, Miracle. He blinked up towards the Ancient Camp and right into the arms of TNC. Can they capitalize on this opportunity? No, it seems like Miracle's able to bump him off. Now he gets the helpful force from GH to bump him on board. Cuckoo can't look to let him go, but Cuckoo now gonna get bit down. Tim's can't bail him out, so Cuckoo's out of this one. On the other front, it's gonna be Cuckoo looking to buy back. He's trying to TB back into action. This could be the final hurrah for TNC to stay alive, but they're already losing more. Raven has gone down. He has no buyback. Liquid just too big, too bad, and too strong here. Back end of game number five, swelling up to 25k of a net worth advantage. Miracle leading out the charge with nearly 25k himself. Here they go in for the final set of racks. Is there any way TNZ can attempt to go for a hold here? They're trying to fend them off. Pushing back GH, but diving confidently inside the base is going to be Miracle. They go on in for the racks. Miracle to zone off TNC so they have no chance in hell of defending. He has got a hold and taken down Tim's. And it looks like this may be it. Liquid going in for the final hurrah. They dropped the black hole and it's good game. Congratulations, Liquid. You are the champions of Star Ladder I League Invitational number three. Wow. That game, it had started all as TNC. But the resilience of Liquid